Hello, everybody, well, and welcome to Friday Morning's Children's of TV. Now, you probably remember me from yesterday. Yeah, that's when um, Gorgehammer has to do but presenting the programs. And I helped a little bit. Well, now that I'm here on this Friday morning, here's some great programs coming your way soon. Now, we may have had the 1996 series of Postman Pat yesterday, so we're not going to bother with that. But however, though, we will be having two Woodland Animation programs, which starts off with Bertha first and then Charlie Chalk. I think George Buxton is a clown. I heard that. Sorry. That's all right. Now, as I was saying, Bertha goes first, and then Charlie Chalk, and we've got loads of other great programs. Oh, yeah. And I'm sure you'll find out what we got this Friday morning. But, to begin with, here is a classic episode of Ladies! And they go over to the puppy star. Again. Ooh, I'll get it up. Birthday! Bye bye! And that was Play Days, it was. And wow, they are very interesting, those. Yep, good thing we are including them for the 10 o'clock slot, which it will be in the morning, you know. So, anyways, viewers, so. Here's the next program, as promised. And you probably remember back in the 80s for when there was another Woodland animation, animated uh, show. Well, here it is. It's Bertha. Lovely Bertha. You are a lovely machine. And George Buxton states, Oi, get over here. Well, here's Bertha. <laughs> We can depend upon you. And that was Bertha, the lovely machine. And of course, however, we'll be having another episode of that next time. And coming up right now is another one from the Woodland Animation Archive. And it's Charlie Chalk, the clown. Charlie Chalk landed on an island, now he's living in the jungle. Everybody comes around to see him clown and watch him tumble. And that was Charlie Chalk, it was. And wow. I didn't even know that they had Charlie Chalk in it as well. Okay, so here's the next program. Now, and I don't know what sort of a next program it is, but whatever it does, it's going to be good. Oh, and of course, however, just a little reminder that Fortune and Badger will be back on Monday. Yeah, very good start, I say. And so, on Children's FTV right now, Here's another random program, which George thinks I'm a braggy bear. Well, here's another episode of The Raggy Dolls. Enjoy! It's not much of a life when you're just a pretty face. Just to be whoever you are is no disgrace. Fingers are all thumbs. Stand on your two left feet. And join our Raggy Doll chums Cause Raggy Dolls, Raggy Dolls Are happy just to be Raggy Dolls, Raggy Dolls Dolls like you and me And uh, that was the Raggy Dolls it was uh, Wow, I even can see the um, sad sack A bigger smile that we that ever that I have ever seen in my life Oh, so, uh, anyway, here, so here we go with the next program and we've got two more programs to finish it off. Con continuing with Dewey's Duck Truck, and then Gordon T. Gover, uh, a friend of Philip Schoolfield. Uh, no, her, it's Schofield. Well, I thought it was Schoolfield. Schofield. Oh, so, excuse me, everybody. 
Oh, uh, here's Toby's duck truck anyway. Schofield! 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 <laughs> a little bit short though, but don't worry, here comes the next program anyway, and here's Gordon T. Gopher! Hello, school field. I heard that! Here's Gordon T. Gopher with Philip Schofield, not school field. <laughs> That was just a one-off for this time. Well, it's just because it came from the VHS release, which you can find on eBay and Amazon. Oh, God, you might need to ask your parents about this first before you can get your parents to order them for you. So, uh, anyways, up here, so here comes the last program. Now, and I'm giving you a few clues. Well, it's something to do with puppies. And sometimes George Buxton is a messy pup. I have not. Cut it out, you. <laughs> Sorry. That's all right. Oh, anyways, you. Now, I know George is not a messy pup. Yeah, I understand that. So, he's a puppy. And he's from African Hound. And he likes to roll around in mud or anything goes even... And even he hates bar. Well, I'll tell you what it is. It's what a mess. <laughs> well, oh, and in today's episode of What a Mess, uh, he goes to school. All right, good. Give me uh, a, a math question. Okay, uh, I'll give you one. Um, what? What does one plus eleven mean? Uh. Oh no, I'm going to eat. A compass team, a kitchen mum, an old fur coat with a bird on top, a moving mess of unpleasantness, good grief, what a mess, eggshells, porridge, bell to rank, is this prince a mere of in jam, in toast and ketchup you'll never guess, oh no, what a mess, though he's not a pretty sight, he really tries to do things right. With a mother who's tall and slim I wonder how she ever thought of him A short but scruffy Afghan hound A more foul creature you've never found A tangled bundle of grizzliness Good grief, what a mess, what a mess, what a mess What a mess Prince Amir up in jam In toast and ketchup you'll never guess Tries to do things right with a mother who's tall and slim. I wonder how she ever thought of him. A shot that scruffy young can hound. A more foul creature you've never found. The tangled bundle of bristly nets. Good grief. What a mess. What a mess. What a mess. What a mess. Um, 
fuck was Watermash? And sadly, that was the last program uh, for today. Uh, only for this morning, of course. Ah, but did I forget to mention, viewers, that today is Red Nose Day! Woohoo! Wow, viewers, I can't believe it. Today is Comic Relief. Ooh. And I also heard that they're getting themselves ready to do a very special day. Oh, and I also heard it's like raising some money for charity. Uh, that's for African children this time. That needs homes. Hmm, that's almost as good as children in need, though. Oh, and, um, if you want to know uh, what her helping hand is, I mean, I am a puppet after all, because, I mean, I have got a big psyche paws, and I'm a bit, uh, flippy floppy feet. Hmm, I mean, I don't look like Mr. Scarecrow or anything. But, just to finish it off, and since it is Red Nose Day, why don't we have a look at the 1991 single A Helping Hand Song featuring all the puppets, including Badger! Enjoy! <laughs> A music video of Helping Hand to celebrate comic relief. They are, because it was, comes from 1991 and it was all the puppets, and I salute them. 
Oh, oh yeah, and I also salute to Bernie and Mr. Wit. And Mr. Bird, Wit and Bernie, if you're watching this right now, don't worry, Mr. Wit. You'll be taking over this afternoon. Oh, and don't forget to tell them about it Red Nose Day. Oh, uh, anyways, viewers, now that was the last bit of the day. And because the reason why we're showing the music video is comic relief. And don't forget, viewers, that well, I will be back in the Big Bird on Saturday night, which is probably at 8.30. That's on Saturday night. Ooh, Saturday night! No, 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 no. <laughs> Get off me! <laughs> oh, hello everyone. Hey, uh, sorry if I have to keep helping no hair bear to do the presenting. Because oh, he gets those names all mixed up. Uh, you know about the Philip Schofield thing with Schoolfield earlier? Well, he's already learned his lesson. Never again will he ever said Schoolfield. Alright, there, mate. You can get up now. Oh. Sorry about it, George. That's alright. So, uh, what was all this talk about comic really? Uh, well, you see, George, it's Red Nose Day, Day. Oh, yeah! I forgot about that. Uh, may I say something serious to the viewers out there just before we finish? Uh, yeah, sure. Alright, uh, but thank you for presenting it for us. You're welcome. Bye bye, everybody! See you on Monday! Bye! Oh, and over to Mr. Whip for this afternoon after the comedy program. Or anything random. Bye bye! And that's no hair they've got now. Right, now, let me just give you a quick note. Now, and the note would be. Now, if you're celebrating comic reading for today, make sure you raise some money. Make sure you raise some money up for charity, because African children will need some new homes. And plus, additionally, with um, clean water and good food. And of course, don't forget that they'll be having a red nose night that's, at, that's starting tonight at 7 o'clock on BBC One. So don't miss it. And I'm going to say goodbye now, viewers. And I'll see you again soon. And I will see you on Monday. Until then, bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Oh, and uh, Mr. Wet, however, will be here later on this afternoon. Goodbye. Coming up next on FTV, here we go with a double bill of the best. And we begin with Maggie's Happy Meal, and then of course we finish it off with a bonus short, The Haunted Happy Meal Blast. <laughs> and that's after the